All right, now that I have your attention from watching the the clutch casserole, just want to say uh, here's something you, we all should be doing. Get the microfish. I've have I have it saved under files, I believe, on most of our sites for the Bandit 400 and the GSXRW. I have the manual. You'll see up here. I have, this is where I'm using the Bandit 400. I have a shop manual, but you can find the pages and print it off yourself. If you can't find it, use one on eBay. Go under Find Your Microfish. Get it all printed out. Something you can always refer back to in conjunction with your manual. So here I'm working on the clutch. Previously, you know, I was working on the transmission. It's good just to know how to read it and to have some way to follow what order you put things back. Because I can tell you, as a, as a dad, I'm always getting distracted and pulled away in the middle of a job. And there's nothing like, okay, what came where? How did I put this around? It just helps you go back to where you started. Plus, I'll make notes and I'll write things down on a piece of tape and stick it on there. Uh, I use blue painter's tape so I can always come back to it. So big notebook for your manual, big notebook for your microfish, print it off, put them in a page savers, <clears throat> excuse me. And then another thing I'll do is I'll, I use this notebook to remind myself, like I'll keep receipts from other products, any little notes I find somewhere, I'll do it. Like here's some thing about pingo options and anything I find on the internet, sometimes you can't go back to it and find it again. So I, I'll print it off if I think it's worthwhile. And where is this one right here is like, I have not been able to find this again. And this is all about the TTS piston kit. All right. So, I mean, right here, here's another one. Yes, just about carburetors. How it's broken down. And then like, where's a good place to get, uh, a lot of the parts, Light Tech. I've used them multiple times. And on the Light Tech page, I printed it all off, so I always have a reference in case I can't get Wi Fi out here in the garage. Boom. Nice diagrams, how to break it down step by step. And even, I think somewhere in there, I think it's either here or somewhere they're telling you about how to stake the little screws for the butterflies. All right, guys. I'll see you next time in the garage. Once again, it's late. My puppy dog is passing out.